Hello, Chris Gray here, and as you know, I love microphones and I love all things technology. But what I wanted to find is I wanted to find a microphone that I could use with my iPhone or with my iPad where I wouldn't have to mic up with a lapel mic. I could just throw a microphone, point it into a direction, and record. Basically, I wanted to find a decent shotgun microphone for my iOS device or whatever device I wanted to record with without the need for power. I basically wanted to have a passive microphone because they do make powered shotgun microphones. So that's when I found Rode. Uh, Rode makes a microphone called the Video Mic Me. And this is a great bit of kit. And let me just get right to it and show you what comes in the box. Okay, so in the box, you get this shotgun microphone. What's really cool about this shotgun microphone, other than the fact that it's passive, it's made in Australia and it's made out of like an anodized aluminum, um, at least in the microphone area, plastic in the back. It feels solid. It has a 3.5 millimeter male end. You can plug this right into your iPhone or your iPad or other smart device or a, you know an Android phone, whatever you can, whatever it'll fit into, 3.5 wise, and you're ready to go. It also has a female 3.5 in the back. Or right, you also get this piece right here. It's like a uh, a rubberish. Um, plastic piece. Now what this is for is when you take your shotgun mount and you plug it into your iOS device or smartphone or whatever, you then use this piece to press and to put pressure so that it won't slide or fall off or or move move around like this because it does have a little bit of weight to it. This is not a cheap product. It runs for about $72 right now on Amazon and I believe there's free shipping um, as the time of this recording. So this is a really nice um, bit of hardware, and I'm going to let you hear it in a second. But what makes it even better is they've included this windscreen, a.k.a. dead cat, as people as, as they call it in the industry. What's great about this is if you're outside using this shotgun microphone, you put this dead cat on it, and it helps to reduce that background wind noise. Now, it's not perfect, but it definitely makes a difference. Anytime you put some type of filter uh, on a microphone, similar to what I have right now on my Heil microphone, that will help with wind noise, with your plosive, your P's, and your S's. All right, so the benefit of having a shotgun or directional mic is that it will pick up basically the sound that it's pointing at. So it has more of a cone, a narrower cone of audio pickup. So with like a regular lapel microphone, which I've reviewed on the channel as well, you get a lot of different noise from all around because it's trying to pick up – it's it's a uh, multi-directional microphone. It's trying to pick up uh, any any kind of sound it can. What's cool about a shotgun mic and shotgun mics or what they use in the movie industry as well to get a more beam of sound. So you can put this on your iPhone or your iPod or your iPad or smartphone and you can point it directly at your subject and it will pick up their audio and it will try to cancel the noise or the other audio around you. Now, because it's passive and because it is a smaller type of shotgun, you know, more compact shotgun mic, it's not perfect, but it definitely makes a difference. Uh, it'll clean up your audio recording. Now, I use it when I'm doing my Facebook Live videos, um, and I've just, I just love it. Now, let's hear what it sounds like on my iPhone. Okay, welcome back. This is the video using my iPhone. So I'm actually using my iPhone to record this part of the video while using the shotgun microphone by Rode, the video mic me. And as you can see, it sounds pretty good, all things considered, with this microphone. Now I'm gonna unplug the microphone so you can hear what it sounds like using the regular iPhone mic. Now, I'm not doing any processing right now, and I'm not using, I'm just using the stock iPhone camera uh, recording app. I'm not using Filmic or any type of movie app. So let me just switch it real quick. Okay, so now I'm using the microphone it's built into my iPhone. I'm not using the shotgun microphone at all, and I'm not using any fancy recording um, apps at all. I'm just using the regular iPhone app. That's what it sounds like. So testing one, two. I'm going to put the microphone back on with the dead cat and see if you hear a difference. Here we go. Okay, so now I have the dead cat on with the shotgun microphone, and as you can see in the video, you don't see any fur or any fuzzies because of the location of because um, the location on my iPhone 6 Plus, uh, the 3.5 millimeter jack is on the bottom, so it doesn't interfere. Now on an iPad, you have to be a little bit more careful because the 3.5 millimeter jack is up by the camera, and if you have it turned a certain way, you might be able to see the dead cat. Just something to keep in mind. So again, shotgun mic, dead cat on here, 
What do you think? How does it sound? I think it sounds pretty good. It's $72, no batteries required, plugs right into a 3.5 millimeter jack. Okay, thank you so much for checking out my video unboxing and review of the Rode VideoMic Me shotgun microphone. I hope this uh, particular microphone solves a problem you may have or you know gives you the ability to shoot and collect the audio that you're looking to get. I know it's been very um, helpful for me when I'm doing my Facebook Live um, and doing my Snapchats uh, as well. Uh, speaking of which, if you'd like to follow me on social media and stay connected, I invite you to follow me on Snapchat, on Instagram, on my Facebook at ChrisJGray7. You can follow me on any one of those social media platforms, C-H-R-I-S-J-G-R-A-Y and the number 7. Uh, thank you so much for checking out this video. I'll have a link to this product in the description. It's about $72 as of the time of this recording. The price fluctuates between like $60, uh, $50 to about $80, give or take, depending on you know which vendor on Amazon. So thank you so much for checking this video out, and I'll see you for the next video.